All right, welcome back. I gotta jack off to get in. Hell yeah. Uh, let's just do the smart thing first. Uh, Snorlax. Snorlax. So we're not fighting an electric type. Oh, Magnemite. My favorite. Hey, we should capture it and use it. Just catch him and put him on the fridge. See, you you did it too early. You I waited this for good. a second and I knew where he was going. See, he loves me. <laughs> See, he already loves me. What do you want to name him, Chris? I want to Nothing? name him Magnet. <laughs> no, I don't want to name him anything. <laughs> <laughs> this is why we would have a shitty Nuzlocke run. <laughs> what do you want to name it? I don't care. <laughs> you literally have to name them in Nuzlocke. <laughs> exactly, but I wouldn't care. <laughs> What's its name? A. A. <laughs> what about him? B. B. Can we do a Nuzlocke and name them alphabetically? Yes. That would be fucking funny. <laughs> I want to do a Soul Link where we both race each other, but if one of our Pokemon dies, if I say your starter and my starter, if my starter dies, yours starter dies... <laughs> That's a Nuzlocke. If you get a capture card, if for your possible gaming room coming in, I will consider this. Because <laughs> uh. we'll both do it and then we can smash the two of them together into one series. Alright, what do I do to not kill him? What no, you want to. You want to kill him. I uh, want to kill him. Oh, punch. yeah, that's right. We yeah, don't do fucking... Punch. I forgot that this game is stupid. Yes. <laughs> Yes, it is. But we actually have a match timer, too, so we can't let that go too over along too much. I see. Oh, he's burned. Well, this is already over. <laughs> Fire punch, Snorlax! Ugh! Belly flop. <laughs> I'll hit him with another sizzling slide, and you hit him with another uh, fire, fire punch. punch. I think I'm going to lick him. <laughs> I'm curious what it tastes like. It's, ah! It tastes like a 9-volt battery! <laughs> <laughs> yes. Eh. Your foe is weak. Now capture him. Did you ever see the fucking that? <laughs> Someone did like a. It was one of those like joke images, and it's this girl sleeping with a nose ring, and he's yeah. like holding a nine volt battery up to the tube. <laughs> yes. like, I'd have it no other it. way. And I'm like, man, that's really funny. Uh, right? Switch to a, a Ultra Ball. <sighs> so good. I can't when you do that. When you do that, oh, Master Ball. Uh, <laughs> yeah, let's, let's waste the Master Ball on this. Yeah. I mean, what's there really to use it in this game? You too. He doesn't run. No, he doesn't. So you could catch him he's, the he's easy way, I too. think I actually captured him in an Ultra Ball in this. The Master Ball is literally wow, only easy. important for Pokemon that run away. Yeah. And literally nothing else. Yeah. <laughs> I've, I literally was playing through... Um, the Diamond and Pearl remix, and I'm mm -hmm. like, I could use my Master Ball in the, the box legendary. Yep. Or I could just save it for you know one of the roaming Pokemon, and then I found the way. Oh, you can do the ro you can cheese the roaming Pokemon, so they show up. All right, Derek. Now use Dig to escape out of here immediately. <laughs> <laughs> or I just you know teleport here and get out of here. That feels like cheating. Yep. They don't have the side door anymore. All right. Well, that's fine. That was originally, you went through I the side door. That. You don't? Really? No. Why are you going on the water when we can just fly Shh. to the location we need to go to? Because I want to hopefully get a, dra a Dragonite through there. This is the only route that it spawns Dragonites. No. Wow, what a Dragonite. <laughs> I am just trying to make sure, you know. Dude, what about the fucking, um... Uh... The place with the Pokemon that free roam. Uh... Pal Park? Yeah. That doesn't exist in this game. Boo. <laughs> what the fuck did you just say to me? What the fuck did you say to me, you little squirt? Ah, <laughs> uh, so we did that and one. And we fly down to the island, and then we literally just go right. Yes, I know. Like, that's, that's all we do. And we just win. And then we win. Yeah, like, we literally, we just win. Yeah, we have all three legendary birds, even though all our Pokemon are higher level than that. Yeah, we don't use them. We just, you, we catch them to assert dominance, Derek. I don't know why I did that. We're gonna go right on the ocean, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, I don't know either. Oh, fuck it. <laughs> My planet needs me. Go figure it out. <laughs> and do I fight the trainers, or I just say fuck it? I think I just say fuck it. I don't care. You can do whatever you want. I'm gonna say right. fuck it now, that because... Sounds good to me. We're in the home stretch, Chris. We're in the home stretch, baby. Baby! <laughs> yeah, oh, but I want this Pokeball. It's like you've got leftovers. <laughs> oh, okay. I'll take leftovers. Oh, that's pretty good. So that's pretty good, actually. What I love is... Did I do that when we played Sword and Shield? Literally just find... What the... 
That Gyarados, that's a Gyarados. is going crazy. <laughs> yeah, that's, like, that's a Gyarados. <laughs> I, when, I, when we played Sword and Shield, did I run and grab the leftovers and just be like, and this is how you beat the game? Hmm. Yeah. Probably. Because it's broken. Cause <laughs> you can capture them. You can get leftovers before the first gym. Actually, Sword and Shield, no, probably not. Wait, can we not do this backwards? No, this is off? how you do it backwards. Oh, okay. Yeah. I was like, they block off this in reverse? It seemed like it. They changed it a little bit, but you still can do it backwards. I see. Oh, uh, uh... Hello. I have returned. My planet no longer needs me. So... Pokeball. <laughs> oh, it's an ice stone. It's a pokey ice. Do 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 slow bro Ultra Ball, excellent. You found three Ultra Balls. That's three too many. So they changed up how this works. So now you just can't like immediately maneuver there. I see. Originally you just walked right through a door and you were like in. Yeah. Cause now there's a current. Dude, there's a shell in Nice. We should capture it. You should capture it. Okay. Because it's on the water, and I don't exist in the water. Unless you shake right now. Yeah, but I don't care. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> I understand completely. But I don't care. <laughs> oh, no. Looks like you'll need assistance. <laughs> From you. Apparently, you will need assistance. What, what the fuck? I can't join anyways, apparently. Nicely done. Sure. Uh, that almost looked like what you did on the, with your hands. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Derek, why even play with your hand? Just strap it to your dick and make the throw. <laughs> I mean, I probably could. I probably could. Huh. <laughs> huh. Ha. 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 I didn't actually mean to come back, but I put my hand down onto my lap, and then it was just like, you're in! <laughs> I think Moltres is right there. But... You keep saying Moltres. Not Moltres. Arthur, though. <laughs> but I need to... So, before this started, Dark was like, oh yeah, we're capturing Moltres right now, and I'm like, Zapdos? And he's like, yeah, yes, Zapdos. That one. <laughs> the one I meant to say. <laughs> and now we're like, you see Moltres is right over there. Articuno? Yes, yes Articuno, one. the one that I said. <laughs> so I need to cap these things. There we go. Oh, you gotta use strength. Uh, it's not strength, Chris. It's strong push. Strong push, whatever. <laughs> More like lame push. <laughs> well, I got to shit. Push. Dark, be careful, don't get yourself stuck. It's very easy to get yourself stuck. Perfect. Now we jump down the hole with it, right? Yeah, soon. <laughs> soon. I love video games. <laughs> Woo! It didn't let me go into holes. It's fucked up. I see what you mean now with the walking the river thing. Now I get it. Because it would have been pushing we us. <laughs> we should save. <laughs> yeah. Uh, give me Charizard. Yes. Give me Charizard. Uh, give me Charizard or give me death. <laughs> I don't even want to play a Pokemon game unless I can play as Charizard. <laughs> oh shit, I didn't vigorously... Don't worry, you'll, you'll be able to get in there. Damn, what a cutscene. Okay, so I'm going to say it right now. Is it just me, or do these look better than the newest Pokemon game they're showing? Yes. Like, I honestly think this game looks way better than fucking anything they've showed for Gen 7. I think I'm just... No, yeah, no, Sport okay, Trainer's coming in. Um, like, I, honestly, man... You mean Gen 9? Gen 9, yes. God, I can't believe how far we're into the fucking Gens now. 
Yeah, no, I, uh... I don't know how to feel about this game. This new game. Yeah. It just... Artistically-wise, I just don't feel it. I get it. Like, the way I put it, because I had this feeling right when I saw it, and it's... The Pokémon are very cartoony, which is fine, but the character models are, like, more traditional anime style. And they just clash super fucking hard with each other I, now, and it looks I agree terrible. completely. Like, <laughs> it just looks really off-putting. It works. What I love is... Only when you're sitting like this yeah. do the balls, like, fucking home in. <laughs> True. Uh. True. But, though. yeah, no, I don't know, man. I really don't. Yeah, I just feel like the art style in the game just clashes really Unless hard they have some itself. dumb gimmick that, you know, I love. Mm -hmm. um, that turns the Pokemon into more anime yeah, characters. Yeah, turns them into anime waifu characters. <laughs> I'm boycotting this game. You can pet Garnivar in it. I'm buying, buying ten. ten. <laughs> <laughs> I'm buying ten. <laughs> so, when do you think they're going to remake Black and White? As <laughs> soon as the world stops being racist, Eric. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> when are they going to release uh, Pokey... When are they going to release... Jeez, this guy uh, sucks. The fuck is it called? Reboot Camp. Uh, Advance Wars Reboot Camp. When there stop being war in the world. <laughs> yeah, good luck with that. <laughs> oh boy. I have a feeling it might come out thing. after Breath of the Wild 2 comes out. So Not... never. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Fucking hell. The fucking ball, oh, bro. It took a while. So, are we using these guys or not? No, they're just... We're catching them to assert our dominance over the region. Ah, uh, yes, you're right. Um, also, could... because we caught them in the last game we played. Right, we did. So, now we've caught them... At this point, we will have caught them six times. And this is going to be a trend, where every Pokemon game where you can catch the legendary birds will catch the legendary birds. So that way we can keep increasing the amount of times we've caught the legendary birds... As some sort of weird count for the channel. <laughs> um, let's see. Because we could play the Ruby and Diamond remakes. Yep. If we wanted to. Yeah, if we wanted Not to. Not Ruby and Diamond. Diamond uh, and Pearl. Diamond wow, and Pearl. that was, yeah, Diamond and Pearl. That was like know, a stroke moment. In fairness, I know what you meant. <laughs> um, so yeah, we could do that if we wanted to. Um, I say we play actual Fire Red and Blue. Uh, I say we play actual Red and Blue. And then Fire Red... And leaf green, and then this one again, and then <laughs> yeah, but this one, yep, this one time we'll play Pikachu, not Eevee, <laughs> and then we'll play that fan one, which was a remake of Pokemon Fire Red and Leaf Green, but made to look like they were made for the fifth generation, and then we'll play. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll only play Generation one, one for the rest of the yeah channel. forever. It just never again will we play anything else, any other Pokemon game, just that. Um, that will be the, the, everything on Tuesday and Thursdays I, every week. I would not be opposed to playing the original Pokemon game just so I can dump dumb knowledge all the time. About, about how it. it's fucking jack. Yeah, about how it's shit. Like, I, like honestly, I'm going to be like, okay, Derek, and now we're going to get, like, Master Balls, and I'm going to be like, uh, no, uh, Great Balls, and I'm going to be Ultra like... Balls. No, Great Balls. Because they're the best balls. Yes. It's not even a joke. They're vastly superior than any other Pokeball in the game. Yeah, it, it, it's weird because of how the coding works. <laughs> the coding is all fucked up. Literally, if you put a Pokemon to sleep and use a Great Ball, you have a higher chance of catching them than if they had an Ultra Ball without attacking them at all. Yeah. You don't attack them at all. Yeah, no, it makes no it sense. Is... <laughs> it, it makes literally no sense. Because um, reducing their health only increases your percentage chance of catching by, like, 1%. In that game, yeah, no. which is totally pointless. It, it literally makes no sense. Yep. The only reason you use Ultra Balls is for legendaries. That's it. You put them to sleep and then use Ultra Balls, let them at full health, and that's the only time that an Ultra Ball is better than a Great Ball. Now, is that also apply to Pikachu and Eevee? Um, or just Pikachu? Uh, yellow, I mean? I, I yellow so. has slightly different mechanics, but they're also equally garbage. I th Actually, no, I think the Pokeballs work the same in that game. I think it was a move Now, that Chris, question for you. Yeah. Do you have the thing for the GameCube that lets you play 
Game Boy games? Yes. In fact. Uh, so, Chris, what yeah, I'm, what I'm hearing here is, if you can figure out a way to record that, I can bring one of my four copies of Pokemon Yellow to play. <laughs> you have four copies of Yellow? Yes. Shit, can I get a copy? <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I might I'm, have four, I might have only three, I but still. I don't have a copy of Yellow yet. <laughs> yeah, but, but I said it like a joke, but I legitimately have four. No, I believe you. It was like one for me, one for Nate. Yep. I think we got another one from, like, my cousins. Yep. And then I think I might have gotten an extra one from my gr my girlfriend. Oh, nice. So I'm like, yeah, I got, like, fucking seven. Yep. I also have three copies of uh, X and Y's. I have an X and a Y, because yeah. one was Nate, one was mine, and then my girlfriend gave me an extra copy, and I'm like, okay. Nice. X and Y is one of the only Pokemon games I don't have physically, because they gave it to me for free on the DS. Yeah, you told me that. So I was like, I guess I just won't buy this. Yeah. <laughs> and the irony is, is that of all the recent generations, that one was my favorite. Yeah, because it also had our, uh, you know, Ruby and Sapphire remakes. Yeah, which was dope, dope. and which yeah. I did buy physically. <laughs> yeah, I, I liked it so much, I literally went out and bought the other version of it. Yeah. Before it was $200. <laughs> Nonsense, Derek. It's 300 Yeah, it's $300 um. <laughs> now. Um, yeah, fucking, uh... Yeah, I got a game... But yeah, I got a Game Boy player for, uh... The game too. So we could play games on that. I mean, we could also probably just emulate them Shh. on the Wii or Wii U but at probably a higher quality anyways. You are 100% right. <laughs> and in beautiful HD. <laughs> um, but I don't disagree. There's um, Or we could, you know, actually you get the downloaded version of it and play it as a download game. Yes. No. Why well, would you can... waste your money on a game you've bought four times? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> but because then I could trade them to new generations of Pokemon. Oh, fuck that. Um, uh, shit, what was I going to say? They actually did make an HDMI, like, adapter for GameCubes, but my GameCube is too new and doesn't have the port needed for it. We'll have to check if mine is not. Does you, if yours has two, like, video ports, it will have, like, an, uh, a, an analog port and a digital port. And if your GameCube has a digital port, I will literally buy it off of you. <laughs> it's like, I don't know. I, I'll have to look. It's, it's, I will literally buy it off of you because I've been trying to get my hands on one. <laughs> that was the one that, um, <laughs> that I got from... Our, our buddy John yep. in a bathroom at the end of the day of school. <laughs> yeah, like a fucking drug deal of 14 liters of cocaine. And he brings you into the bathroom and he's like, oh, Hey, you got the money? And he fucking unzips the bag and fucking opens it up. You get to peer in and be like, Yep, that's definitely the GameCube. It was the fucking <laughs> sketchiest shit. It was very, like, it was very much like you were selling fucking cocaine in the bathroom. Oh, well, it's just like, are you okay, John? Dude, I gotta go catch my bus. Dude, I need to follow me to the bathroom real quick. Am I gonna get shanked? Is he gonna murder me? <laughs> that was the funniest shit to me. I, it is a proper fear. John could have murdered you. <laughs> With his bare hands. Dude, he was a monster. Oh, <laughs> uh, fuck. The kid was ripped as shit. <laughs> Dude, it's a magic car. That's how magic cars swim. Yep, that's how I remember them swimming. See, that's why they only know splash. They can't even swim in the water properly. They just no. splash on top of it because they're lighter than water. What I love is if you look at um, magic harps in Arceus, mm -hmm. they actually are swimming, and I'm like, that's not how they should work. <laughs> yep. How they should have worked is like a legitimate how they how they do in this game because that's just stupider and funnier. Yeah, everyone knows. Everyone knows that magic carps are lighter than water, and they just float across the top of it and flash. And everyone knows. Absolutely. Yeah. So I think you're actually still playing, even though I'm surfing. Oh really? That's weird. Yeah. It probably just hasn't despawned me yet. But you flew away, which makes no sense to me. All right. Well, that's actually confusing. <laughs> Or maybe it's because you put the controller down when you, uh, got up. Oh, and then it respawned me. <laughs> maybe. I can see that. Ah, 
cube. We got a Polygraph and a Polywhirl. Now we just need the other one, whose name I forget. Polyrath, Polywhirl, Poly... Muscle? Polywag? Yes. It's the first one, right? Polywag? Yes. And then there's Polytoad. Yeah, Polytoad, which is the dumb one. That just, doesn't make any sense. Yeah. <laughs> which is a trade evolution with a specific item, which is the most annoying thing. Originally, that was planned for Gen 1, actually. If there's like concept art for Gen 1 of Poly Wrath, the final form of him having like a weird crown on his head and being like extra jacked. And he uses the rock crown in the next game, but he's not extra jacked, he's a frog. Interesting. So they like reused the idea, but didn't go with the original design. <laughs> That's very interesting. Oh, yeah. Which I, I hate that guy so much <laughs> because he's like one of the hardest fucking Pokemon to get because. He needs a King Rock. Yes. And King Rocks are, awesome. are super hard to get. <laughs> yeah. yep. A, mm -hmm. they're also super, super, there's like only one per game that spawns normally. Yeah. And they're actually a really good competitive item, so you don't want to just get rid of the King Rock. <laughs> what does it do? It, it raises your chance of flinching. Right. And it just gives a normal That's moves right. chances to flinch. Yep. And if you combine it with a multi-hitting move that has... Um, I was not ready. That's okay. Yeah. <laughs> if you combine it with a, poke, a move that has multi-hitting things, yeah. they can hit up to five times and each has a like 80% yeah, percent chance to flinch. It. Yep. And makes sense. if you get a Pokemon that has, I think it's called Skill Link, mm -hmm. which makes it so those moves always hit the max number of times, if they go first, they have an automatic chance. They have like a like a seventy percent chance to flinch your Pokemon. Nice. Which is like, yeah, no, that's that's if it's not a hundred percent, it's fifty <laughs> percent. But no, it like always would flinch things. Like I remember, uh, I had somebody rage quit on me when I was using that Pokemon. I mean, rightfully so. It sounds like you were being a big asshole. <laughs> well, I mean, I was using fucking Cloyster, and they were using a physical type type Pokemon, and I'm like, that's not how that works. That's exactly how that works. And they were like, why isn't your thing dying? And I'm like, because you're bad at Pokemon, Ryan. <laughs> Jay is Derek. Tell me how you really feel. <laughs> I feel like he thought he was better at Pokemon than he is. <laughs> and then I whooped his ass. <laughs> With my belly drum resumeral and my... Is this the is this the Ryan that... You think so. That I know of, or is this a different this Ryan? This is that Ryan. Oh, of course. The belly drum resumeral with my cloister that had skill link and a king's rock. <laughs> and that's literally all I used to wipe his team, and he was so fucking butthurt about it. <laughs> I didn't even know we played Pokemon. Yeah. <laughs> it's, I guess in all fairness, everyone played Pokemon, though. That was back in back high the, school. Yeah, back in high school. I seek battle. Will you battle me? On guard. <laughs> I see battle. Will you battle me? Nah. No. <laughs> nah. He's so smart with his fucking ditto. Dude, he's gonna send it out a ditto, and we're gonna murder it. <laughs> ditto, use transform, and it transforms into the female Pokemon trainer, and everyone just kind of like... Just the sweat starts pouring, like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Flamethrower. That's reasonable, right? No, it transformed. Which one do I want to be? Of course. But it's okay. Everyone wants to be I a Charizard. Because I expected this. <laughs> it's everyone wants to be a Charizard. I expected it, so I turned into a, uh... I used water. Mmm, delicious water. Water. It's almost like Charizard's the better Pokemon to transform into. Yep. That's alright. I have a secondary strategy. Dragon Pulse? Dragon Pulse, <laughs> yeah. Or use the X move... <laughs> With the mega evolution and fucking murder it. I just had a moment I'm like, the fuck is the X move? And then I'm like, oh yeah. I forgot that X, I forgot that megas were a thing. <laughs> yeah. Because so did Pokemon. <laughs> Dude, what I hate is like, they keep, they introduce these cool mechanics, like these, mega evolutions. No, Derek, you're using the wrong word. You said cool mechanic where you meant to say new gimmick. New gimmick, yeah, I apologize. <laughs> they introduce these gimmicks and they only stick around for one generation. Yep. And that's how you know they're good. Yeah. <laughs> and it was funny because people were like, I hope uh, Gynomaxing um, is not in the Diamond and Pearl remakes. Ooh. Spoilers, they weren't. No. 
But After we're done talking to this man, we're going to have to call it here, though. We'll pick it up in the next part. We'll see you guys then. Peace.